a one-time punishing runner on the field, now on the sidelines, he is feared because of the beard. You know, I'm not really sure if it's a signature look, but it's something that I definitely uh, have held on to for quite some time. Follow my line as best as I can. At Omaha North, Clinton Childs was clean shaven, a blue chip All-American, destined for stardom at Nebraska. I wanted to be the starting eye back and uh, prove to the, to the whole state that, you know, I can get the job done. A two-time national champion, Childs scored 10 touchdowns as a Cornhusker while splitting carries with the likes of Calvin Jones, Damon Benning, Amon Green, and Lawrence Phillips. I think we were all fortunate to be there at the same time. I mean, simply because, you know, you just don't see backfields like that. And, uh, you know, any of us running backs could have played, you know, at any other Division I program, but, you know, we all chose to stay there. Like many fellow Cornhuskers, Childs found that natural progression into coaching after his playing days. He has spent the last 26 years coaching high school football and wrestling, with the last 11 coming here at Omaha Northwest. These are the same kids that I was when I was their age. You know, I'm born and raised in North Omaha, uh, was raised by a single mom. It's a driving force for me to let these kids know that it's okay to be from North Omaha. You don't have to be around or be from other areas in the town in order for you to have success and to become successful and be able to do some really good things with yourself. Few on his team know of his past. Childs likes it that way. He would rather help focus on their future. In Omaha, Matt Lothrop, KETV Newswatch 7 Sports.